three days you don't respond to your father. I was worried sick, boy. Yeah, I needed some time to myself. I saw your whole funeral in my head. I could see your mother. She was so beautifully broken with her black lacy veil. And Devereaux was useless. I was the only one that could comfort her. I took her out to the gravesite and I started giving her a back rub. And the next thing you know... Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. I get it. You banged mom up against my headstone. Well done yourself. You know, you got the morning show in an hour to promote the fight. I'm not going. I'm not doing that. You're not exactly a man of substance, are you? You're a quitter, Tommy. Eddie, just stop that! That youngster was okay, but he, he, he wasn't all that great. Dad, I just need you to go now, okay? Obviously, it's my fault. I should never have had children. And they'd be better off a wasted stain on the bed sheets. Tommy, get me a kitchen knife. I'm gonna sterilize myself. <laughs> right this second. Okay, I, I, I see what you're doing. All right, Tommy. You do it. I want you to sterilize me. The least I can do! All right, I'll go to the bloody morning show. There's less drama there. You have to get a shower first. No, I'm good. I'm all right. No, my son. You stink! <laughs> I've been fighting old men and bombs for a month. I need something higher profile. Oh, this is the fight I've been waiting for. The small woods and the tuckers.